Hey there, this is created by the graphic designers of RCN Worry branch, right? And they did a very nice work, the color blends and everything. But as far as I'm concerned, it's not a successful design because the purpose of every design is to pass a message. Now, I want you to take, take note of this word here F O U N D, blah blah blah. Even the A here is covered with this castle. And then the T, blah blah blah. So basically, this team here says foundations, but the average person will not be able to know the meaning of this team. That is, they will not know that that is a word there. It looks beautiful, but design is more than that. Graphic design is not just you creating beautiful things. It's creating things that has um, design that has meaning. That those are functional design. Your design should have a meaning. It's like you want to write this address here. And you just write to use a font that is a very funny font and then people are not able to read the address if they can't read the address how can they come for the program so if you want them to know the mean like you want them to know the theme of the program don't break long font like a word that is called a long a long word like foundation don't break it like anniversary don't break it when you are breaking it you are separating the word it looks fine in your eyes but you are actually doing rubbish right it looks beautiful in your eyes the colors everything are there but it's not a functional design it doesn't pass the text of graphic design the the purpose of graphic design is to pass a message to an intended audience all right so you can correct me if i am wrong in the comment if your design does not pass a message to your audience because you you use a font that is so stylish or you break the text the way you're not supposed to break it or you use a yeah you just don't com communicate the language the message very well they will not understand it so i want to redesign this particular design just to show you how that this same design can still carry that message foundation and yet somebody will see it and see at first glance that this is foundation i would together so let's go so i'm going to clear this i'm going to bring in this i downloaded this using ai all right I ask AI to generate for me this castle. All right, so I'll, I'll still be using it as you can see. Oh, let me see crop here. Okay, I'll still be using it. Drag it. All right. All right, so that is that, right? Okay, so what I want to do now is to save this design. Just save it. Alright. Now I'm going to do use a perspective effect here. I have to go and create the text. Oh, come back here. So I'll click here, I'll create the text. So I will write the text here foundations. Alright. I'll use a long font like um Bibans now all right i'll just drag it like this okay i'll do this close up the space a little okay then i'll come here okay so something else we're going to be use, doing using okay let me leave that then we're going to still work on maybe okay let's leave that we're going to still work on this so let's just do everything at once come here copy so 9 of february 9th right so let's go zero nine february so okay they say long font copy february right type feb all right then reduce it and put it there then 2025 right and put it there 2025 all right then reduce it and put it there wow okay then at the bottom there we have um 3 30 pm all right, so let's copy this. 3.30, three thirty, then PM at the bottom. So like this, then we're going to close this up. Oh uh, no, come here, line spacing, then close this up. All right, then move it up a little. All right, then bring this guy here. Okay, this shape here. Bring it here, bring it here. Do this, come over here reduce this then um just do one two three it's okay then use the white color all right then fix it here 
okay right so lock it and then try to fix it at the middle here reduce this one small okay let's try to move it here okay so that is it right so that is basically the part of the design that will be um um that will, that will add to the slant okay so come here click here click here click here save as png all right i saved it as a png all right let's go back to the design now we're going to come here we're going to open the design again all right so this is the design we're going to come here import the one you just saved as a png so i'm going to crop this out so this is this is the main guy here so what i'm going to do now is to use the perspective tool so to do that i want to drag the x towards this end here i will drag the, P, the f towards here so go to this place click on perspective enable it um something's wrong touch it again perspective okay enable it then move 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 then move this guy here are you seeing that now so see what i'm doing it now i'm dragging it so that the s is coming from that other side and this one is coming from here so we can we can zoom like this so that we'll see exactly what we're doing so i want the x to fall in from this part here right then the p the the f coming from so let the f even touch this guy here i want the s okay let's see I want it to oh uh -huh, exactly that's cool i want it to touch that part there all right you can see now so all right so then we can come here we can change the color now there are different colors from the original design that the text used so let's bring in the original design and pick some of those color and mix them together all right so some of the colors are these so i'm going to click on this i'll go to color now go to gradients and i'll select this color i'll click on this the blue here we can pick one of the colors here so let's say this right we can add another color we can come here and we can change this color to let's say um this yellow dark yellow here then we can touch this color uh, okay let's see mm, okay so let's try to move this guy here no 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 Try again okay still try again move this one here okay all right so i've done that you can see the foundation showing very well so i'm going to i'm going to i'm going to click again and i'll go to um shadows now add the shadow to it and i'll try to control the shadow view. all right so i'm controlling the shadow i'm bringing it down all right see that now okay see that now so, so you see that from, from, from a glance, you can see exactly what this thing is talking about, okay? You can see it from a glance. All right, so I'm going to bring in this other guy here. Um, this. Um, copy this, this, this. All right, so we're going to look for a place to put it, to fix it, right? So uh, we, can, we can just come here, change the color to this color. Or we can pick the same color. All right, so um, we're, going to, we're going to adjust this guy now. So to adjust that, we come here. Okay, so we enable that. We move. Let's move it. Okay, so I'm moving it as if it's now for me sitting on the other side of the um of the castle. Are you seeing that now? It's resting on the other side of the castle. Then I can come here to add a shadow to it. Okay. So I move this. Then try to adjust this. Okay, let's go to the side. This okay. This time around. Okay. All right. All right, see what I did. I did now. Okay, so I can bring in this. Um, um, this. Okay, no need for this one. Let's delete it. I have one already saved here, so I'm going to bring it up. All right, I bring this one up, so I can um, put it here. Okay, we can still put it here. All right, you seen it. Everything is taking shape now. So to get this address in a very slanted way so it's the same thing all we need to do is to uh, copy the, this whole information uh, where is it so we'll copy this old information uh, copy right all right i copy the old information then we we'll save right then 
you want to still play that game, you can come here and paste everything here. Um, paste. Right, then um, change the fonts to this guy here. Or what is it? This guy here. Then this guy, you change it to this. Alright. Reduce it. Or fix it like this. Alright. Then all you do is come here, save. And let's move back to the design again. So the goal of your design is that you want somebody to look at your message and understand it. You, you as a graphic designer, because you broke the text, you can easily understand it that that is foundation. All right. But it's not everybody that can understand what you are doing. And you should make everybody understand what you are doing as a designer. All right. So I'm going to do this now. All right. So the same font right here. So, so that we can apply perspective to it. So I can go over here right enable it then i move like this 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 you see that now right so that's that so you can just reduce it if you want or fix it there so you can come here and change the color to that color of your choice maybe this or that all right you can see that everything is taking shape already Right, so it's better that somebody can look at it and say, Wow, this you are talking about foundation. That for a person to be confused, not knowing exactly what your act means. All right, a person should be able to understand your message by just glancing through it immediately. So, right here, we're going to um, get this um, 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 Pastor Reverend Kessiana, Evangelist Kessiana. So, I'll just type here Evangelist Kessiana. Am I correct? A Siri. Alright, so we'll just come here and I'll do this. Pick this font. Pick it. Don't forget to like this video and then share it with your friend who you want to benefit from this awesome channel. So I'm gonna put it there. Okay, so I can even use, I can even use white here. Alright, so the other information we'll fix them now. All right, so you can see that everything is where I ring. So by looking at the design, just looking at it, I can see that that, is, that word there is foundations, All right? Compared to this, where you can you are beginning to struggle and say, what, what is this? Is it is that F? Where is the A? Is, is the A hiding? Is the S hiding? Don't break your text. Allow the text to be one line, All right? So that is it. Do where to like this video and share your thoughts in the comment section. Did you learn something today? My name is Nehemiah, and I will see you in another tutorial. Thank you for watching.